Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. Today's video is going to be, as you can see from the title, my four-year-old is going to choose my makeup for me and I'm scared. So without further ado, here is my <laughs> ginormous four-year-old. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> this is Alexandra, everybody. How old are you? <laughs> Four! High five! Good job. Oh, she just smacked me in the nose. Okay, so I have all my makeup laid out over here. Go, go over and stand by the makeup. She's just gonna choose uh, what we start off with. I have no makeup on right now. Sorry, I'm like breaking out really bad as you can see all over the place. All over my face. Yeah, let's just go ahead and get this started. Okay, cool, cool. She's starting off good. I actually ran out of primer, so I'm not um, giving her that as an option because I ran out. But she did choose foundation first. Oh my gosh, she chose foundation first. And then now I'm also going to... I gonna... like foundation. Yeah? I'm also going to give her the option um, to choose which one of these. So. Which one should I use it with? Ah! Okay, she chose the brush. So we're going to go ahead and start off. We're using the Fenty um, Pro Filter Soft matte long wear foundation in the shade 150 still have to go shade lighter that's pretty yeah okay so the foundation is on the brush wasn't too bad all right next step what do we want to do next It. That's what we want to do. Okay, so wait. Oh, you want this one? She had the option to choose from um, Anastasia Pure Hollywood Morphe Brunch or Kat Von D Hawkeye. So she chose Hawkeye. So we're going to do that next. Thank you, darling. Interesting technique. Oh, she said I need to do this. Okay. Lip skits. She says lip skits, by the way. Lipstick is on. What are we doing next, Sandra? Oh, also, didn't put these out, but I'm gonna give her all of my eyeshadow palettes to choose from. After several minutes of deliberating, she chose, I'm so happy she did, the Sultry palette. What makeup should we do next? Pick any of these. And any of this, this whole entire area. Maybe this. Okay, we're gonna do blush next. We're using the Tarte Amazonian Clay. Mm, smiling, but actually crying on the inside. <laughs> blush, done. What's next, Alexandra? Okay, we're doing bottom lashes. Um, so this is a look. It's coming along. I'm using the Smashbox Full Exposure. Um, mascara. I was having a moment. And I'm gonna put that on the lower lashes because that's where I put it. I love you, Mama. I love you too. Okay, bottom lashes are on. What's next, Alexandra? Okay, I'm gonna do eyeshadow next. So I'm gonna have you pick my colors too, which is probably a bad idea. Okay. So you can pick, do a light color, a dark color, and a sparkly color. So three total. I like this one. That, okay, well that would be the glittery one. And then we need a dark color. I like this one. Okay, now we need a dark color. Okay, so not a bad selection. She chose the shades Rose Quartz, Bloom, and Dystopian, which I'll show you. This is Dystopian right here, Rose Quartz, and then Bloom. That's the ones I said, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna do that next, which is gonna be interesting. I don't know why I'm talking like this. It's so pretty. Oh, so pretty. Oh my god, I can't prime my eyes. Oh. All right, so we're just gonna start with the shade blue. I was taking the shade Bloom on the Sephora number 38 brush, and now I'm gonna take the Morphe M43 Rock M431 and dip it into the shade. Are you shade. gonna tell me I, I have all these colors? In a second. 
and I was using the shade Nystopia. That? That's my wolf. Sandra. I lost her. She's on stickers and she got distracted. All right, what are we doing next? Interesting. This one. This one? This one? <gasps> next, she chose some setting powder. Next. Okay, we're doing um, mascara next. It's gonna be hard to put eyeliner on after I have my lashes on, or like mascara. Okay, so that's done. And what's I got next? The flower out. Woo! What's next? Concealer on after you've already set your face on powder, that's gross. Okay, now, Alexandra. The question is are we using a sponge or a brush? I look brush. insane. A brush? Oh. <laughs> I literally talked about this in my my high school makeup that if I try to use this brush with the amount of concealer that I wear now it would take me 40 years to blend. Taking forever and I'm putting it all over my blush. Okay Xander what is next? This one bronzer woo I have a little morphe uh bronzer in the shade Debbie Tot and Got it from Morphe Girl. Get you some Morphe products. Using the R7, and I'm gonna very carefully put this on without going into my finger. No. The brush? No, the. Hmm, it's wiping it off. The finger? The setting spray. I mean, setting powder. <laughs> Bronzer is on. What's next, Alexandra? What are we doing next? Highlight. We're doing oh, highlight okay. next. Yes, now you need to pick a shade. So, which one do you want? Oh, I love you so much, girl. You are my favorite. And we're using the shade Moonstone on the Morphe M510. And I'm going to set a little bit of setting spray. Alright, Alexandra, what is next? I feel like this is like a game show. Alexandra, what is next? Okay, we're gonna contour the nose, girl. We need a snatched nose, okay? Okay, open it! Okay! 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 She picked the darkest color. Okay, we're gonna use the darkest Can color. Put it on you? Nope, it's okay. I got it. Thank you though. So oh, that is so dark. Is Remember what I just said about having a snatched nose? Is yeah, that is not what is happening here. Right. Okay. That's done. What's next, Alexandra? Eyeliner. We're just gonna leave this on for Okay. <sighs> 
wanna see your makeup is true. She was testing it to see if it's dry. I think that's actually the last thing, so wipe this off. If I went out in public and I didn't tell people like what the process was of doing this makeup, I don't think you'd be able to tell that the process was the way that it was. Because it doesn't look that bad. I'm kind of proud of Alexandra. She's definitely my daughter and she knows what the heck is up. it for today's video this is the completed look I'm actually not too disappointed with how it turned out it actually came out pretty good like I said before in my last video I will be doing a little bit more of like an in-depth review of the new palettes that I got and I did use a little bit of the sultry palette today but I will be doing like a full um, like swatch and all of that on another video this was just like a little glimpse of how everything came out so yeah be on the lookout for that thank you so much for watching um just comment down what your favorite part was or what you thought the craziest part of this whole video experience was like this video make sure you will hit the subscribe button and hit the little bell that's next to it it just notifies you whenever I post I post every Tuesday and Friday and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one bye